Hey YouTube, quick question for the uh, Jeep guys running a 2.5 liter, particularly anyone that's ever rebuilt one. This is a freshly remanufactured short block. And if you can see, we got three bolts lining everything up on the timing cover here. And unless our gasket's gonna start out at over a quarter of an inch uh, or more, uncompressed and compressed very little, this is looking like a no-go as it is setting right on top of the cam bolt right now. And we'll uh, pull this off and give you that view. We're not quite certain what timing gear sets on here. We think it may be a melling. You can see some of the stamped markings in here on the gear set and the way the gears are looked. It's like that uh, burnt finish on the crank gear. Everything looks good. I mean, it's a brand new timing chain set and believe it's been ran in. We're just wondering with that timing chain cover because the cover that goes with this engine doesn't seem to fit. And again, not something I'd really wanna tempt fate with trying to do anything crazy. So I'm wondering if anybody else has ran into this problem, if you'd mind just dropping a comment down below what you did. The only thing I found so far on one of the Jeep forums, somebody physically took off their timing gear set completely, I think replaced it with a cloise set and gained the clearance they needed. And the only thing hasn't been done here yet, because we're gonna call the engine remanufacturer Monday when they're back open, would be to pull the, uh, to pull the cam retention bolt and washer, which by the way is a huge washer, but to pull that out and then measure to the depth of the uh, cam bows where the bolt goes in and kind of get a comparison for what the depth is and how much of this bolt actually goes into the camshaft. So if anyone has an idea, drop a comment below, let me know. And we'll uh, see if we can get this thing solved and back in my Jeep's twin, which I'll show you that in a future video. So thanks for watching. Thanks in advance for any help you can give us. Stay tuned.